walk all the way around. Ugh. Ah. Ugh. Oh crap, I'm really tiny. No. Uh. Wonders of ham cam where I can't reach my mouse or keyboard or you know anything. All right. Oh shit, I didn't change the music. Oh well. <laughs> Tell me if the music is too loud, okay guys? Because I... will have to stand up to get it, if it is. Ah. 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 Headphones. Hi! Hello! My hands are going to be so hot by the end of this because gloves on top of gloves. I didn't have any black gloves, so clear it is. It's very low. That's okay. It's just supposed to be background. Hi! Hello! Uh, so we haven't done resin in a long time, but when I tell you that I have colors and that I have glitter and that I have more glitter and more, I am not exaggerating. I have a lot. <laughs> so we're gonna make some pride crafts. Hello! Rip. Rip my TV. <laughs> Why did I just throw all this stuff around? Like now I got to organize it all. What the fuck is wrong with me? Who knows? Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. So we're going to do some pride stuff. We're going to make pride stuff, which basically just means we're going to make rainbows. Rainbows. BDO. Uh, is that Black Desert Online? Because the answer to that would be no. I played it for maybe an hour back when it launched on Steam. Hi, Cerny! Hello, hello! Blech. All right, so what we're making, well, my headphone cable might be seen at some points because it just well, refuses to stay up. Okay, so this is um, the mold we're going to be using. Um, what it is, I'll try and show you guys. It's a light. It's a moonlight, so it will stand on this like that. And it will glow through. Woohoo! Send you help? Uh, I don't know that there is help for that. <laughs> the other thing I have is I have dice! We can make dice! We can make our D&D dice! Because I never play D&D, but at least I'll have, I'll have my own dice. So we'll, we'll make some rainbows. And if we have lots of leftover, we still have our keychains from over a year ago we still have keychain molds from that so we're gonna start by making a lot of clear and then portioning out into colors i have lots of little cups we're gonna have to make a lot of clear for this mold i have two here that are mostly full and then i have two full ones off to the side if we need them, which I think we will. I think what I will do. The funny thing is it's a one for one ratio of these two. And I can tell by looking at them that I definitely didn't go one for one last time. <laughs> Whoops. I hope these don't go bad after like a year. <clears throat> Who knows? Oh, God. Oh God, Ooh, that's hard to open. I did it. Yay, I can open caps. I'm not, I'm not weak. Okay, so we'll do 40 mils of this and then another 40 of the other into this one and then do the same thing in the other cup to start. This will not be enough. No way in hell is this enough, but we start here. We start here with our clears. Because I do want to do my goal <laughs> is to mostly fill it up with clear and then use the droppers to squeeze in like lines of rainbow, you know? So that is my goal. Will I achieve it? Who knows? <laughs> the other fun part, I'm on a time crunch because I have to leave by 530. So five is pretty much my stop time. So we got to do this fast. 
sorry that you guys can't see what I'm doing, but I have to measure these things. And I can only do that by looking at the measures on the side, which means I have to raise them up to my eyes. Woo! Okay. Get back in there, resin. And I have to be very careful because resin is very difficult to clean up. This is something I learned last time. It was fucking awful having to clean it all. It was so bad. <laughs> all right, now we got to mix for three minutes. How am I going to do this with two hands? Oof, oof, oof. Oh boy. Is anyone timing this? <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Oh, I am not left-handed. I am not ambidextrous. Ah! <laughs> This is why people get those automatic resin mixer machines. All right. Go. Or they use uh, drills <laughs> with attachments. I hope someone's timing this because I sure am not. <clears throat> okay, it's 314 now. So we go until 317 and some change depending how fast it flips over. Oy. Who wants a hand workout today? Because you're getting one. Oh, don't don't flip over, please. And I remember it was like, make sure you get to the corners, blah, blah, blah. They also recommend like heating this stuff up. Did I do any of that? No, no, I did not. I am not a professional. I don't claim to be a professional. I'm gonna switch hands. <laughs> of course I do, Megan. <laughs> it's mostly because the stream legit is took me as long to set up as it will to actually do the stream. That's the crazy thing about hand cam streams is they take so long to set up they are very very difficult to set up Ugh. my fiend geez but have a good safe ride home megan and if i don't see you later in stream i will see you later in general <laughs> uh so you have a laptop grybok which is a big help for you um because yeah you have to basically set up everything you have to set up your whole setup and then you have to have your camera and you have yeah i do but i haven't set it up for streaming oh boy well then you're gonna be carrying everything into the kitchen absolutely everything and this is why my desk is on wheels. <laughs> the only problem is my desk is very large. <laughs> I'm going to keep going. I know it's been three minutes now, but I'm going to keep going a little bit longer because I am switching back and forth. That way I can make sure these are nice and done. There is definitely some stuff in these cups from the last time. <clears throat> oh, well. Oh, well. <laughs> I could just get like any dog hair out. That would be great. <laughs> there's some people who make really beautiful, perfect things. And then there's me. Okay. Let's see. Okay. That's a big piece of something. We'll just slide that out. Nope. Stay out. Oh yeah. That had a dog hair on it. See, I have a dog. She does this stuff to me. Okay. We pour that in. Yeah, we're going to need so much resin. So much resin. Holy shit. I don't even know if I have enough with all I've done. But at least we can make the base of this. We 
might have to do a part two. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Like this is going to only fill up like a quarter of this. <laughs> No, wait, are those on the bottom or the top? There's dog hairs in here. God damn it. <laughs> I hate my, I love my dog, but she is messy. Thank goodness I have tweezers for this. Yeah. This is like a little piece of something fuzz. Okay, okay. Mm, itchy head, itchy head. Okay. The next one in. Now we get to do it all over again. But that's okay. That's going to take a little while because I do want this to set up a little bit before I get the colors in there. but we're just gonna have to do the best we can with what we got it might only be half done <laughs> and that is what it is we can always do a part two like that is the nice thing is i could just do a small layer of the colors and it will still work because then i can just finish it by having the entire back be clear and make more clear in the future. What is this? I think it's glitter. I am so glad I waited to do this stream until I could set up my kitchen for it though. Holy shit, this stuff on my desk. Such a pain in the ass. I love the fact that this has been kept in a closed area, closed box, closed room, closed everything, and yet my dog has infected it. Power of husky hair. Let me just double check. Make sure there's none over here. Doesn't have to be perfect, but I would like it to be dog hair free, if at all possible. I think that's as good as we're gonna get. Boop. Okay. Remember I said I had more if we needed it? <laughs> like we weren't gonna need it. Ugh. Open. Oh good, these are even a little bit bigger than those. They warned you not to swallow this stuff. I did. I didn't see all of it, but I did watch. It was so good. I love her new um, her new skin suit. It's great. It's a great skin suit. Ooh, I'm going to have to rewatch and see it all because it did look like there was a shit ton going on. How much is in this bottle? That was, oh, just shy of 40. Cool. Yeah, I think it was really cool that they did that. I loved seeing the concept art and like how they got from point A to point B. I thought that was really cool. I love that kind of stuff. I'm such a nerd.
it is funny that people uh, were like calling her flat and I'm like mm, yeah no she's got something under there <laughs> and she was like if you think this is flat you've watched too much anime and it was like yeah yeah you're not wrong girl you're not wrong now we stir we mix and we stir and we mix and we stir more 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 <laughs> <laughs> I love that she kind of looks like a chocobo actually her hair is like so chocobo it's cute I love it <laughs> yeah it's a really good model and i like how unique it is like it's not tech wear it's not like no offense to tech wear says the person wearing tech wear but yeah there is a lot of tech wear in the vtubing community so it's nice to see something a little bit different oh my hand is gonna cramp <laughs> if i do lots more resin in the future i am definitely gonna have to like invest in like proper tools like a bigger cup for resin and stirs <laughs> automatic stirring machines oh my god i would love would love that yes your pain begins today i'm excited i think i get done well so I teach doggo classes right now and tonight's the last night of my late one so i should get done around the time that you start so i'm looking forward to popping in once i'm home and trolling you tee <laughs> Okay, we're almost up to the halfway part. That's good. So we should actually be able to fill this whole thing. Once we mix all the resin together. <laughs> Literally gonna have to use every drop I have. Ah, I spilled some. You, in there. You're needed. My people need you, Resin. Get in there. I could always do like, you know, if I can get it up to about here, which you guys can't really see, but like three quarters of the way, then I could just do a um, clear, uh, <sighs> clear backing, which is totally fine with me. Can you guys hear that? It's lappies. <laughs> All right. More resin. More. Oh, God, there's caps on it. Um, Come to me. Okay. 
There's the hardener, and this is the actual resin. So yeah, uh, Grybock, when are you going to play DVD with me? Hee <laughs> hee. Come on, play DVD. Don't you want to hear Leon S. Kennedy scream or Nicolas Cage? You already scammed me out of hundreds of Valo bucks. What do you mean? I did nothing. I have barely played, I barely played any Valo last season. I was just not in the mood for it. <laughs> you do know I play a shit ton. <laughs> this always happens. I mean, I'll play Vala with you. I'm just in a little breaky break right now, you know? I went a little too heavy on that, so just adding a tiny bit more. So we keep our one-to-one. -one. All you gotta do is, I actually do want to get a five sack for Valo and do hee 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 fun times. So maybe I'll poke you for that, Grybok. Soon. What other game have I done that to you with though? <laughs> oh what do you think of the new overwatch um battle pass i feel like it's up your oh i see i see i see yeah i mean to be fair valorant is free if you spent money on that bitch that's on you yeah i had a feeling you would like it it's not my style but it's pretty good if you're if that's your style like it is pretty good i do like the ash skin but i was kind of like mm. eh. <laughs> on the rest of it but i i'm looking at that life bringer uh uh lifeguard skin i like more of the skins in the past than the mythic yeah i get that i get that it's definitely they're so they're very different like the ash skin feels very um it almost feels like it goes more with the tracer mythic like the the dnd type how long have i been stirring this i have no idea ow my hand Yeah, it's very fantasy versus those which feel like Power Rangers and Gundams and stuff. And then you have the one Junkrat skin in there that is a lifeguard skin. And you're like, where did this come? Yes, the Sentai. Yeah. Which go with the um, Genji Sentai skin, really. But yeah, I was like, it's so weird that they have the one random lifeguard skin for Junkrat. And uh, it makes me think they were like, oh, we'll put Lifebringers uh, lifeguard skin in the past. And then they were like, oh, wait, people will pay for him because he's the hot new, new, you know, new kid on the block. The internal name oh my god that's awesome that makes sense suits perfect
So the funny thing is the other day I was like, man, I wonder what they're going to do when they get Orissa a mythic skin. And then I realized she already had one. And I was like, man, they did that. They did my girl dirty. That one does not look mythic at all. There are two life card skins with the ultimate pack also. Two more in the shop. Yeah, I think Kiriko and Life Weaver are going to be separate along with because I believe the ultimate pack didn't have them, I think. Arissa. I feel like hers doesn't look very mythic. It looks like every other one of her skins. All right, now we have enough here. It's half full of clear. Perfect. We can go and get the colors. get started building our colors Oof. okay the whole thing's just gonna move fine fine that's how you want it ah my hands are cramped from that okay we need a blue We need a green. Mm -hmm. That is a little bit more red. Only black. We have an orange. That looks good. We have a yellow. I mean, surely we have a yellow, right? Ooh, here's a good yellow. And that's a good red. We just now need a purple. Woohoo! Rainbow! Sorry, I'm not doing more colors than this. I'm not getting that precise. We go in with the general pride here. <laughs> Basic bitch pride. Okay. We don't need much color at all. Tap that clean. You guys can't see this one, but I swear it's there. There. Wait. Nope, that's as dark as I got. Okay. We'll see how this turns out. This could turn out really terrible. We'll see. Yeah, the dice um, as well. I was like, oh, well, if we need time, if we have extra resin, we'll do those. And if we don't, there's always another day. Come on. Get. There we go. Orange. You can see my fingers are all like, they're like sticking together. And this is why I have rubber gloves on top of the regular gloves. Because I didn't want to ruin my wolf mitts. All 
Oh my god, I can't open these things. Because my gloves are sliding up my fingers and therefore I don't have the dexterity to get in between the folds of plastic. <sighs> Still debating if we do any glitters. All right, now we got to build more resin. More resin. Here, microphone cord or headphone cord. You out of the way. One, two, three, four, five. Well, I'm going to need to steal one of these, but that's okay. Because they each are going to need their own stick. Let us measure. snack i look forward to eating you later no 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 oh, that went slightly above okay hello 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 okay so there's at least enough for one more cup of this once i'm done I am making a, we're going to make a little moon lamp that will have pride flag rainbow streak through the middle. So the mold right now just has clear in it and we're making our colors right now, but we have to stir for three minutes. Oh, Blech. yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we've got, we're going to have fun. We're going to make cool stuff. Move these so I don't accidentally hit them. Do, 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 do. Fascinating content, I know, of me giving myself carpal tunnel. Eh, 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 eh. 
Unfortunately, it has a 24 hour cure time, so I won't be able to pop it out of the mold and show you guys final product till tomorrow. So interesting how like, I'm gonna try something real quick. I know I still have to um, stir these more, but I'm gonna do something. I'm just doing a little back and forth between the cups to make sure the mixture is as even as possible. That's a good way to mix too, is just move it back and forth between two cups. Also, one of them has slightly more than the other. No idea why. I said this before the other day when I was at the dog park. And I had a moment where I was like, oh my God, I have to be normie. How the fuck do I do that? For this one dog, she like climbed over another dog and was standing so that that dog was like right under her um, at her hips. Uh, but the problem was she couldn't get her hindquarters up over that other dog. And she was like stuck. And she was like, ah, 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 <laughs> like freaking out. And I'm just like sitting there going, do not say it. Do not say it. Do not say step bro. I'm stuck right now. Please do not say it. You fucking chronically online loser <laughs> do not say it it was it was the biggest struggle of my life guys i'm not gonna i'm not gonna lie i was just like oh god oh god <laughs> that's when you know you you spend too much time on the internet <laughs> we Spend three minutes. I'm gonna go a little bit longer. You can't over mix. You can definitely under mix. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. And. Oop. Oop. All right. I have one doggo. She is a Siberian Husky. She is loud. <laughs> but she is a good girl. And she is currently asleep somewhere. Somewhere around here. At some point, she will let us know that she has had enough of being a good, quiet girl and would like attention. <laughs> Man, the color is getting on this cup. There we go. Okay. Our goal is to pour this evenly between three cups. We'll start small and work our way up. <laughs> okay. This will turn into the red stirrer. Okay. Stir these each one by one and get them all mixed in so that they become our colors. Ooh, 
Yeah, Mike's fortunately not loud. She just tries to um, yeet herself out of the bathtub and uh, attack the dryer. But she's, I'm really lucky. I have a friend who's a groomer. And so she does my grooming uh, at her house where she has her own grooming tools and salon. And so then I can stay with my dog and hug her and help with the whole controlling her and keeping her from needing herself out of the tub thing situation. Because I have had, I have come to pick her up from groomers and had them looking like they had just, you know, been to hell and back. And they were just like, she really doesn't like baths. I'm like, no, of course she doesn't. What dog does? Like, <laughs> like they don't like it. It, 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 that's why I pay you all this money to groom them. You don't even have to cut her hair. You just have to bathe and, you know, brush her out and dry her. It's not that bad. And they're just like, they were like, she tried to throw herself out of the tub. I'm like, of course she did. Why wouldn't she? That, that sounds like her. Orange is mixing so well into this. Red was a little bit more trickier. The orange seems to be doing good. Hey, yellow time. Yeah, exactly. Dogs are gonna dog. That's, they are literally going to dog. They are dogs. They dog. I think that particular salon was just used to um small show dog types i was like no mine's a working girl she big she loud she strong but she's really good overall like she doesn't care about getting her ears cleaned um getting her nails dremeled isn't too bad she'll fight it a little but not too bad she doesn't mind her paw pads being shaved um she hates being brushed but she's all right with it she does all right she's overall pretty good she does only takes about an hour to do a little bit maybe an hour and 15 not too bad um and i'm lucky as well because since it's my friend <laughs> she um like if she has a last minute cancellation, she knows I'm looking for an appointment. She, uh, she'll just call me and be like, hey, can you get here now? And I'll be like, on my way. <laughs> and so I'll get last minute appointments and she'll give those to me at a discount since she wasn't gonna get paid anyway. So she's like, eh, I might as well. And then she also, she charges me based on how long it's gonna take her to clean her shop after my dog has come in. So when she's not shedding a lot, we get charged less. <laughs> Which I think is hilarious. Like, yeah, I know. It's it's a rough time right now on this day. Her mix and she's a big poof. Yeah. Oh, I know a I know a German Shepherd um that is 90 pounds a female German Shepherd. And she is a the biggest scaredy cat. It's so funny. She's getting better though. She is. She's gotten older it's funny because a lot of people will be like man they all all these dogs seem to go through this stage and blah 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 and i'm like yeah it's called they're going into teenagehood and they're no longer you know they're no longer brash little puppies who know they can get away with anything like they are now dogs so they're nervous about life <laughs> <laughs> it's natural It's kind of like how when you were a teenager, you, you changed, your personality changed, a lot of things changed. You became a different, moodier person for a while. Your parents hated you. Dogs are kind of the same. We don't hate them, but they are different. Ba -ba, ba -ba. 
Trying to tilt this so you guys can see the purdy purple. Yeah, we're doing re resin. We doing resin. Building our colors right now. Our mold is half full with clear because we're going to be doing like little infusions of color in a, in a nice little rainbow. I still haven't decided if I'm going to add any glitter. I think if I do, it'll just be like a little bit to add a little bit of sparkle, like um, a silver, maybe. The other thing I could do is add the big white glitter a bit, like a bit of this. As it sticks to my fingers. I also have this one that has moons and this one has hearts, moons, has all sorts of shapes in it. This one also has moons and stars and flowers and stuff in it. This one is just big glitter. What do you guys think? Some silver, small silver or big white? Should we add, should we add glitter? Or should we keep it as is? And when I say add glitter, I mean very little, just a tiny bit, just to give it a little bit of extra shine. Because we want to add that in. If we're going to add it, we're going to add it now. So I was thinking of just putting a tiny bit in the main and mixing that through. Because these will be like shoots of color through there rather than hopefully <laughs> rather than being all mixed together. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> We are experimenting here. We have no idea what's going to happen. But it's a rainbow. How bad could it be? What do you think? Why are the silver? I think the silver. It's going to be so messy, though, because I'll have to put it in a plastic bag like this because they don't stay. These pouches are not resealable because someone did not think ahead when they packaged this glitter. <laughs> They did not plan for this. Let me grab scissors. My sticky. Everything is sticky to me. A stick. We must be careful not to spill this everywhere or else I will never get it all out. Okay, we'll do like... Ooh, actually when you mix it up, it's lighter than it looks, so that's good. We'll just do one thing and then we'll mix it in there. Put this over here. And hope to God it doesn't spill. We have one clean one, so we'll just go like this. Just for some shimmer. I was hoping this would be set up more than it is, but I guess it's good it's not. Get into the corners. Oh my god, the bubbles come out. <laughs> you know what it is setting up a bit? That's good. There we go. Trying to knock out any bubbles. Okay. It's got a little 
little shimmer now. Just a little. All right, how do you think? So I have two ways I could do this. I could just dump it in each way, or I can use an injector thingy. My worry with the injectors is that I will not be able to uh, get them cleaned out between, because I only have three. It means two colors are gonna have to be overlapped. Well, let's try it. What's the worst that happens? It slowly goes up. These are not the best proper things in the world. I'm doing this blind, which is not great. I need to move all of this closer to me. Boy, if this table right now is not a metaphor for living with ADHD, I don't know what is. <laughs> like, woo. It's just, uh, okay. So that did work. Yeah, that did work. It is in a line kind of thing. I need to move this back. God. As I swirl it all around. All right, we'll keep going. That's cool. It's working, guys. <laughs> My fishing is coming true. Slowly but surely. That's so cool. I wish you guys could see it from the side, but like, I know it looks like, well, you guys can barely see it right now because of where I have it positioned. Yeah, getting molds clean is really hard. It's really hard. All right, I think what I'm gonna do is work the other direction. Suck it up. Suck it up. I might have spilled some of the purple. <laughs> yeah, it's like quick. This is why the whole table is covered in plastic. This is why. This is the entire reason why this is covered. I have literally stuff stuck to these, my fingers. And I can't get it off. <laughs> Resin is so messy, guys. I'm not going to lie. It's super messy. Be careful if you work with it. It is such a pain to clean like 
having your workspace covered i get um the plastic painters drop cloths and i just cut them up and then i use a uh, painter's tape to uh tape them down <laughs> Ooh, yeah the uv ones are supposed to be good for curing um they do say like um you can put these you kind of want them in a warmish place they do suggest um i've heard people suggest putting them in like a window so that they can get the sunlight That's why I got these plastic cups. I mean, it was like a 50 pack for like two bucks. Um, and I got them because I figured that I don't have to clean them. I can just throw them away. They're just little bathroom cups. leveling thick board to keep the surface level but it arrived bent oh my god oh that sucks that pissed me off man i hate when stuff like that happens yeah i'll probably use um i'll probably cover a cookie tray cookie sheet with um some like foil or wax paper or something and then uh use that to carry this whole th whole thing over to the window and set up there and i'll like put it oh bookcase right there or i can put it on top of my dog's um crate which is right there by the window no phone i will not answer you oh shit it might actually be a call i need to answer and if i don't answer they're gonna be like eh. give me one second guys <laughs> never mind i missed the call <laughs> down I think that's the best way to clean these out like that Do -do -do. orange orange you glad I didn't catch that phone call I won't be because I have a feeling of what it is. And the last time I missed their call, I had to call back and I never heard, was able to get an answer and they never returned my voicemail, which was really fucking annoying. Why do you give a callback number and let people call you back if you're not gonna then answer those callbacks? Though I will say, I told them to call me between the hours of 8 a.m. and 12 p.m. So if they called me outside those hours, that ain't my fault. That stopped being my fault at that point.
see how this turns out. If I don't like it, I can always just pour the resin in on each place, you know? Can each just pour each color in. That's the fun thing about this project is I'm not going for precision or perfection. I'm going for fun. Yeah, this actually has hardened up a little bit, which is great. Exactly what I wanted to have happen because I want the colors to be more like swirls. And to be able to go down in the resin itself rather than just float on top or, you know, totally dilute. Ooh, it really is hardening up. Like it's moving now. I might have to work quicker. I might just have to pour because I don't know that I have time to keep going this slow. It is like what you can see. Wait, which one was my clear one? God, I have no idea. <laughs> I think this was the clear one. Who knows? Let's see if I can get this. Oh, here, I have these. So you can actually see, like, it's actually getting hard there. I didn't even realize that was happening until just now. It's only, though, in the middle. <laughs> yeah i thought it would take a lot longer so with that being said it's time to pour We'll see what happens. Get in there. Get down there. <laughs> we go fast. This is actually like kind of hard here. That's crazy. I had no idea it would do that fast. Quick. Get it in there. The good news is it's rainbow. I'm like actually punching through hard bits make sure it gets down there ah. some of the purple has come over no no purple stay in your lane The orange is like on a move. It's like trying to go across the thing so fast. Like no orange, get back, get back there. All right, last of the purple in. Quick. Go. 
The yellow is really the only one I worry about because the orange looks like it has just gone all the way over. But it is what it is. I want to try mixing this lightly. I don't want it to be static. definitely want it to have a little bit of movement between the layers. We've got some more yellow here, so we'll pour that in. All right. And now we are going to mix the last of the clear all together so that we can put it all together and like have like the last layer. Um, so as far as my resins, I've got two kinds. I have this one and I have this one. No idea. So they're just what I got. Wee! This is fast cure, it says. Four hours till demold. Oh, that's where we went. Because this one is 24 hour and this one is four hours. Oops. Oops. <laughs> well, that explains some things. Then I'm going to add a tiny bit of our silver to this. Just a little. Just a little for some more shimmer. Three minutes. I forgot to check the time. <laughs> See, this will say three minutes stir. It does not. It says nothing. <laughs> it says absolutely fucking nothing on it. Stir, 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 stir. Yeah, we'll probably do the dice another day now. <laughs> now that I know this is quick here, it's a good thing I uh, got to getting the colors in there quick. That's crazy too, because I had just, I don't know, five minutes earlier stirred through the color or the, the silver and it was no problem. And then all of a sudden it's like already hardening up. I was noticing something I wanted to address. 
there on that edge. Yeah. Sort of fixed it. Sort of. Yeah, it's so fast. Holy cow. I don't think I'd get this super quick set stuff again. It's too it's too difficult to work with because it's so fast. But in some ways it's good because like it's already gonna harden up here. So this pouring this clear in shouldn't fuck up what we have too badly. Like I want it to mess with it a little, but not horribly. Okay, I think that's long enough. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. That's pretty subtle, which is what we want. We don't want to lose everything. We want to keep our re actual rainbow definition. A bit, at least. Last one. This one, we're just going. Because we're going till they're empty. Yeah, exactly. It gave a really cool effect. As long as we don't totally fuck up the color wheel, we're all good. Oh god, the, the glitter is stuck to my hands. Okay. I'm just going to use the mixer. I'm going to have to buy new mixers anyways. should be cool though like i didn't want these to be real heavy colors just because since it is a light i want light to come through it <laughs> but a lot of what they were showing in the picture is like getting artificial flowers and stuff and putting them in here with clear which looked cool but i wanted you a pride moon <laughs> but that's the nice thing at least with the mold is if it comes out bad, I can just buy more resin and do it again. I have plenty of color. I once again did not check the time when I started. Will I ever learn? Probably not. Probably not. We'll see how it goes. We stir, 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 stirring till our breast breaks off. E. Yeah, I definitely would like to do this with dice eventually. So we'll have to do this again. Just get some more resin and make dice. <laughs> yeah, I've got a mold. I've got a mold uh, right here. You can see. And it it does it has all the dice so i'm ready to do it i just gotta do it <laughs> hello i can't see blue kirby couldn't see the name <laughs> i use dark mode and when i'm this far away it's a little hard to see the darker color names on the black background of obs all right, I'm going to start from the middle this time. Oh, that's perfect. We have like the perfect amount too. 
Okay, I'm glad I went from the middle because it pushed out some of the middle colors a bit. And we still have a line, a, de a definitive line there. So that's good. Okay. I am not going to touch this for like an hour. Once it's set up a little bit more, I will put it on a tray and take it over to the window. And I, even though I used more than half of it was quick cure, I am not going to touch this for 24 hours. There ain't no way I'm touching this. Also, my fingers are so sticky. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we'll do resin again um, sometime soon. And we'll do our dice. Um, when we do that, we'll do like, we'll make, we'll get like lots of colors and make them like all sparkly. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I'm like fascinated with the fact that my fingies are sticking together. I'll take that. Oh my gosh, I took off the gloves and there's more gloves. Oh my God, even with the gloves, like, all right, so wearing these gloves, makes the the sweat build up from the the vinyl gloves better than normal but oh my god the moment i took them off my hands feel so much cooler ah. Ooh. i mean what gloves these are just wolf these are wolf mitts nah. mitts nah. yeah we made our pride our pride lamp we will we will have to see how it turns out i'm really Cross fingers, my fingers are actually like, yeah, yeah, my mittens. I don't know what I got on them. Like, I don't know if you guys, yeah, you can see it. See that little circle? I have no idea what that is. No clue. But they're compression gloves and they have little grippers on them. So they're great for hand camming because then I can, they like go all the way up my arm, like all the way to the elbow. So it, it, Otherwise, I have to wear long sleeves and it's so fucking hot out. I do not want to do that right now. So this is where we're going to call it for today. I'm so excited to see how this lamp turns out. I will be sure to put it on Twitter. I say knowing that I have a long history of failing to do that, <laughs> but I will do it. I will. One of these days, I will post all the pictures of all the things. <laughs> But this will go on the shelf next to our detective famous agency and our Gundam that we built. Yay! I have a whole shelf now of things we've built together. <laughs> uh, we are going to do another ham cam stream probably next week. Uh, I want to get back to our Pokemon painting um, that we were doing. So we're going to do that for sure coming up. Uh, I'll let you guys know the schedule is on Twitter or on the just chatting screen of uh, this stream yeah it's a uh, paint by numbers of pokemons we started working on it months ago and then stopped i hope to god the paints haven't dried out because <laughs> that would be a problem <laughs> yeah we'll um so the schedule is up so when it's when i'm offline you can just go on twitch and click the chat button and then it will show you the schedule that's the easiest way i found to do it but it's also on Twitter, which the Stream Elements bot spams out once in a while. Uh, and so I'm off for the next two days because I have a puppy shower, as in like a baby shower for a puppy. <laughs> and I am making, um, I'm actually making, so like what people do a lot of times who are doing dog training is you really need a lot of pockets because we have stuff, but if you're a woman, you understand that none of our pants include pockets. It's a problem. And I really wish you guys could see my hands. Uh, someday I want to get my arms uh, rigged so that you guys can see how much I talk with my hands. Because I'm like, seriously, like, da, 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 da. but yeah, we're going, I'm going to a puppy shower and I'm making, uh, so I got a lot of people wear hunter's vests, so they have all their pockets. But the hunter's vest that this person has is, um, it's ugly, it's brown, it's gross, I don't like it. So I got her a hot pink one, and I am using glitter glue and stuff and decorating it with, like, her name on it and, and a silhouette of her dog. And it's gonna be sparkly and pink and fun. <laughs> so, 
yeah that's that's what i'm almost done with that but i have to finish that up which is why like you can see the paint this is like some of the paint that bled through from that um uh so i've got to finish that up which is why this whole setup had to be built anyways this is why i like delayed doing this stream because i knew this was going to be messy and i knew that was going to be messy and that way i could put the two together uh in the same spot <laughs> So that's actually drying over on my dog's crate right now. <laughs> so once this sets up, I will switch them. Um, but yeah, I'm doing that. And then I'm also going to be making, um, I have to make a dish. I was thinking uh, I'm going to make um, japchae uh, glass noodle salad. Um, so it's just like some veggies and glass noodles and you stir fry it. And then what's good about that is it can be served warm or room temperature. And since I'm gonna have to bake it, make it and then carry it over to the house, I'm noticing bubbles, so I'm going to poke them out a bit. Um, but since I have to transport it and stuff and it has to sit for a little bit, I figured that would be a good option because whenever I bring something hot, they always get too cold on the way. Like the only way to avoid things getting too cold is holy cow this is already in some places like in the middle it's already pretty firm like it is hard for me to push in Woo! that was a little more aggressive than the edges it's not i'm just trying to tap out any any bubbles but yeah so i've got two days to Get all set for that and i'm dog sitting tomorrow so that's why i'm off the next two days then we will be doing um thursday we have two streams one in the afternoon which will be fire emblem three houses Ooh, they have frozen japche at trader joe's oh my god i have to go there i have been meaning to go there because i really like their frozen like um mandarin chicken and um teriyaki chicken because they're so good to like chuck in the microwave or the oven real quick heat up some rice and just be like done i love that it's such an easy meal and it's tasty i'm now gonna have to go there i'm gonna be next week in the area of trader joe's so i will i will be sure to go there thank you for for looking out i'm gonna that is so oh my god it's actually hot it's actually hot down here. What the fuck? That's so weird. It's actually hot. I hope this doesn't combust. <laughs> oh my God. If it like melts through, I'm going to lose my mind. What the fuck? That's so weird. It's fine. I hope so. <laughs> but yeah, um, so yeah, Fire Emblem Three Houses on Thursday, uh, as well as DBD at night with Corvo and Zeta, and then someone new who Corvo's inviting. Uh, their name is Moon something. I forget. Uh, I forgot. I forget. I I haven't met them before, but they seem cute and cool. So I'm excited to meet a new person. Yay! Social activity. <laughs> uh, and then we will do Hearthstone on Friday. Dark Souls on Saturday and more Fire Emblem on Sunday. So that is the week. Like I said, schedule is up. Thank you all for coming out. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to forgive me because I'm gonna have to like scurry around my desk <laughs> to get it to switch over. But thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll get you guys ready out. And until next time, don't go getting eaten without me. Bye-bye.